a very good morning to our distinguished guests. We welcome you to Spectrum, the Patrician Fiesta 2010. We hope you all have a wonderful time. We welcome our chief guest, Mr. Tapos Banerjee, Mayor of Asansol. <clears throat> Mr. Tapos Banerjee is also an eminent lawyer who holds education close to his heart. Sir, we are honored to have your presence here this morning. We welcome our community leader, Brother Steve Fernandez, Brother T. Samuel, who is in charge of the postulants, and all other brothers. We warmly welcome all the religious present here this morning. We extend a warm welcome to all the heads of the various schools, coordinators, teachers, parents, and students. Now, I request our senior school coordinator, Mr. Nigel D'Souza, to lead us in prayer. Kindly close your eyes as we go to the Lord in prayer. Lord, we thank you for the many blessings that you have bestowed on this great institution. We thank you for the success of Spectrum over the years. As Spectrum enters its sixth year, we once again commit this great fest unto you. Lord, we believe that you are present here this morning and thus this place becomes holy ground. We acknowledge you as Lord of this place and we bow down to your presence. Amen.
come October and the excitement among students and teachers alike is palpable. Students in St. Patrick's and neighboring schools are immersed in frenzied activity. Enthusiasm is at an all-time high. And why not? It's spectrum time once again in St. Patrick's. The fest has grown in stature over the years. And each year, an honest endeavor is made to present something new so that our students can traverse uncharted waters. Spectrum is not about winning or losing, but about reaching out to the student and teaching fraternity in a gesture of love and goodwill. It is about breaking down fences and building bridges. It is about reaching beyond what is generally perceived as acceptable. Yes, it is about pushing back the boundaries. This year, Spectrum exhorts the students to be the spark that sets change in motion, to be the generation who looks up, reaches out, and lifts our region, to be the ones who say, someone will improve things, and that someone is me. Reach high, for the stars lie hidden in your soul. Dream deep, for every dream precedes the goal. To drive home this very sentiment, Spectrum 2010, for its theme this year, the striking words, reach out. an expression of one's individuality. People are astounded by the professionalism and charisma that pours from the stage when talented dancers perform. We have our very own talented group of dancers who will enthrall you with their wonderful performance.
Victim, the patrician fiesta, has entered its sixth year. The sea of this spectacular fest was sown in the year 2005. Each year, the fest provides new vistas to the students to showcase their talents. The students of not only St. Patrick's, but also neighboring schools, keenly look forward to this event. This event creates a strong bond between students and staff of various schools. At the end of the day, each one is a winner. Let us sit back and relive the journey of Spectrum, the journey thus far.
Now, our school head boy, Anirban Don, and deputy head girl, Diksha Sinha, will introduce you to the theme song. If our arms were reaching out towards each other and our words could only bridge the doubt between our hearts, we cannot lose this chance again. The roads are strange, the signs unknown. We don't even know where our paths may lead. Every morning, our eyes see the same sun as we look up towards the sky we will work it out somehow let us just give it a try
often forget that dreams are renewable. No matter what our age or condition, there are still untapped possibilities within us and new beauty waiting to be born. We shall now take you on a foray into the world of a young, disabled, but spirited boy who not only has a dream, but masters the strength and courage to rise beyond his challenged existence in the pursuit of his dream to experience the ecstasy that he is of owing to his disability. He does not allow his limitations to crush his spirit to live life to the fullest looking at what is left rather than what is lost. This young boy stands as a testimony to the fact that nothing is impossible to a willing heart.
chief guest, Mr. Tapo Spanaji, to light the ceremonial lamp. Across. 
young boys and girls. This fest is for you. The tragedy of life is not to have, not to reach your goals, but the tragedy lies if you have no goals to reach. It isn't the calamity if your dreams aren't fulfilled. It's a calamity, not a dream. It isn't a disgrace, mind you, if you do not reach the stars. The stars are everywhere. But it's a disgrace if you have no stars to reach. So reach out. Do what you can. What you do to others brings blessings you never expect. Never be afraid to share. When you share your blessings, it comes back to you. You know, I am reminded of a saying, very old. When you reach, reach out to the needy, it's a hill we all need to climb. Reach out to the lonely. Feed the hungry. If nothing else, give them a cold water to drink. Is that too much to do? So I urge you, young boys and girls, reach out. Your life, your future is ahead of you. I know you want to reach high, but reach beyond, beyond the clouds. The clouds may seem to you dark and may come as a hurdle, but try and reach beyond that cloud and you will see the blue sky. You know, I just read this, reach the Israelites. They feared crossing the Jordan River into the promised land. They hesitated and God sent them back to the desert for 40 years to wander. Till until a new generation would arrive. So don't miss that opportunity. Reach beyond obstacles. Reach beyond your comfort zone to a world where there is none. They don't have a comfort zone. You reach out. Reach out beyond that zone. Reach beyond the rainbow. I'm sure you're going to see a dazzling bright light. Especially for you. When you see the sick and the pain all around you, the so much sickness, this pain all out. Can you feel untouched? Will you feel untouched? Will you not go out and stretch out and give your helping hand? I must, I must share this. I read two days back in the Times of India about this simple, ordinary person called Narayan. The headline said, Nurses, Doctors and Narayan. I thought, what is that? Nurses, Doctors and Narayan? So I read it. I'm sure many of you would have read it. It's about this ordinary man, poor, in a place, Nadia, district Nadia. And he, in the year 83, he's now 52 years old. In the year 83, he was running high fever and his brother brought him to his health center. After he recovered, he didn't go back. He stayed on and he is still there now and everybody depends on Narayan. There are nurses, there are doctors, there's Narayan. He gets a paltry sum. They've arranged to give him a paltry sum of rupees 750. Even that, he uses it for all the patients over there, there are people, this other side of the story, there was a 
a person who brought his daughter with severe stomach ache and she was brought to this health center and when the doctor said that a USG has to be done, a sonography has to be done, the parents didn't come back. Narayan, from his money, he collected from everywhere some amount of money and he got the sonography done, he got her treated, now she stays with him and she calls him father. These instances, they are heroes unsung. We don't hear of them, only once in a while the papers tell us their story. So, children, I would request you to reach beyond yourself. Know what you want and love what you do. You know, I feel, I also believe that every man can be filled with constant and unexpected encouragement if he or she does his level best. The higher you aim, the higher you will reach. And when you are reaching, reach as high as you can. No matter how young you are, or all of us, we've grown older. You know, caring for others makes, keeps our own soul from growing older. When you reach high, look around you and see what you can do as contribution to society. See that, what, what will be your contribution to society, to the nation, to the world. So, when you're reaching, reach high. Keep reaching. Do not waver at any cost. Do not waver. Be focused till you touch God's hand. And then you will be an instrument in God's heavenly band. Reach out. Reach out for peace on earth. Peace be to all of you. Thank you very much. In the words of our founder, Blessed Edmund Rice, were we to know the merits and values of only going from one street to another to serve a neighbor for the love of God, we should prize it more than silver and gold. One thing you may be sure of, that whilst you work for God, whether you succeed or not, He will amply reward you. Have courage, the good seed will grow up in the children's heart later on. It is in keeping with the vision of Blessed Edmund Rice, we at St. Patrick's High Secondary School have endeavored to reach out to the less fortunate amongst us and thus Naidisha was born eight years ago in 2002. We firmly believe that we are not isolated in this vision and that it is shared by many schools. We now make a small presentation to the principals as a token of our solidarity with them in their effort to reach out to the marginalized.
नमस्कार आई प्रथम कृतज्ञता जान सेंट पैट्रिक स्कूल प्रिंसिपाल मिसेस सीमा पाल के तरह अनुष्ठान आमंत्रण जानर एखे उपस्थित अन्न्य स्कूल शिक्षक शिक्षिका बिंदु प्रधान शिक्षयित्री बिंदु अभिभावक बिंदु एवं हमार प्रिय छात्र छात्री बिंदु हम सबा सीमा पाले के सुनल जे थीम टी आज के दिन नहीं आज के दिन खुबी समयपयोगी मैं निजे सीमाना छड़ाते हैं जो टार्गेट जो लक्ष्य से उच्च के उच्चतर पर्या नहीं जो है तपर से थेमे थकले चलो ना से चाली जो है धारावाहिक प्रक्रिया कन्टिन्यूस प्रसेस टार्गेट एक थे एक शिखर थे शिखरे जी चले जाए क्या आल्टिमेट जगह पोछते पर रिच आउट स्वार्थपर हम चलो ना प्रसंगे कविगुरु रवींद्रनाथ एक गान लाइन मना करते आपन होते बाहर बाहर दाड़ा बुकर मजे विश्वलोक पाबी सारा जो निजे बाहर बाहर दाड़ाते निजे बाहर तेल बुके जो सारा पा अनेक मानुषे कान्ना अनेक मानुषे जंत्रणा बुके बुझते मध्यमे परिकल्पना करते चिंता करते मध्यमे कि मानसे दुख कष्ट दूर करते आज के स्वाधीनता तेष्टि बचर पे गे एक समय अनेक कि आज के अनेक कि आज रिच हाई ये आदर्श जो उदबुद्ध ना होतम आज के जगह पोछते परतम ना आज के कृतित्व क्यों आज के जरा ऐले मे आचु बस बड़ो जे सब आजे निजे जगह भारतवर्ष जगह पहुँचे दिए प्रसंगे एक मन मोस्ट पड़े अपने स्कूल स्टूडेंट जो मैथमेटिक्स अलिम्पियाडे भारतवर्षे प्रतनिधित्व करी विश्वास करी सेंट पैट्रिक स्टूडेंटरा एक दिन तरा थीम के आदर्श कर थीम के आदर्श कर ले देखें साफल्य तुम्हारे हाथ मुठर मध्य चले आस आगामी दिन निश्चय तुम्हारा भारतवर्षे जो मुकुट से ही मुकुट एक पालक तुम्हारा आज जो करते थेमे थे चलो ना साफल्य जाना थामिए ना दे साफल्य जाना माथा घूरिए ना दे रिच विहान एंड बी दल्टिमेट उनार सकल के धन्यवाद जाना विश्वपितर का प्रत्येक मंगल कमना आगामी आगमन दिनगुल सब ही भलो काटुक यही कमना कर बक्त्य शेष कर धन्यवाद